Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Into this particular video, I'm going to show you how to manufacture the end liquid soap. It's a formulation that I'm going to give out, okay? It works so well, you can consider giving it a try. If you're stopping by the channel for the first time, make sure that you subscribe. Smash that like button for me. Also consider to drop us a comment below. Before moving further on, I'd like to introduce the book that I've recently published, okay? It's a very powerful tool. It's on detergent and household cleaning product manufacturing. It's also available on a PDF format, okay? For you to get it, there's a link into the description box. You can just click then access the book. We've made it accessible, also affordable for everyone. That's it. Let's get back to our main topic. As I said earlier on, I'm going to give out a formulation on how to manufacture the end liquid soap, okay? We're going to state ingredients, also give their respective ratios. Here we go. Let's look at the ratios making end liquid soap. Amount of water should be 53,6% of the total volume. Formalin, 0,2% of the total volume. Urea, which is your clarity agent. 1% of the total volume, slash 25% should be 20% of the total volume, dye QS, okay, QS that stands for quantity sufficient, you have to put the dye according to the appearance you want to give to your product, perfume 0,2%, SDBS 20%, then CDE 5%, that's it. Thank you guys for watching and make sure that you subscribe to the channel. As I said, you can consider getting the book, okay? There's a link into the description box. You can click on it, then access the book. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel and see you on the next video.